Vanessa Franco. Welcome to another edition of PE Live. We are here in Hangar 24 in Redlands and I'm joined by the shape of the earth. Thank you guys Hi. so Hello. much for being here. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. I <laughs> yeah, yeah. So tell me a little bit about how did the band start? Uh, it started with me in 2008. We, I, well, I recorded an EP. I went into the studio and I sent a bunch of songs to record. And, uh, and it, did, it did okay. We got some response and people liked it and that encouraged us. And so then we started playing shows and then he joined and then it got bigger. It got bigger. Sense. Yeah. It became like actually the size of the earth yeah. and the shape of the earth. <laughs> well, we're not there yet, right? But. They needed a ride to Alderaan and they approached me and my associate <laughs> and we decided that we could give them a ride for a couple thousand. We had some debts to pay off. All right. uh, of course, we were intercepted along the way. Alderaan wasn't there. Well, of course, when they got there, so I just got stuck. So did you guys, have you guys known each other for a long time or did it really yeah. start from the music? No, we, we knew each other in high school. Yeah, middle school. Middle school, middle school, school even. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, they knew each other in middle school. I met Gavin. I moved to the area uh, a long time ago. A long, long time ago. In 2001. And uh, that's when I met Gavin. Yeah, yeah, no. We've been making music together a long time. We've been a have to be here. So it kind of was very natural. They got bigger. What happened is that I released an EP in 2008 and it was very solo and introspective. And it was good, but I didn't really want to do that. So I recruited these guys who I've been working with already. Uh, and it got a little bigger in the sound. <laughs> so, how does the songwriting process work with you guys? Uh, I don't. Wait, I, a lot of this stuff happens, I write some stuff and then I forget it and then they tell me that I'm bad. And then we kind of And then it gets better. And that's what I meant earlier. It gets better as we work on it together. Um, but there are a few things that Kevin brings. And then there are a few things that everybody sort of contributes here and there. But as far as like previously written songs, riffs here and there. You ever seen the movie Ben Hur? Yeah. Remember the scene where they're rowing the boat and have the guy hitting the drum? That, that's you. That's what we do with him. We chain him up and we just hit a drum and we pick up the tempo and if he doesn't write a song in that time. Right. You know what happens. You know what happens. Yeah. Deadline is your best friend. That's what happens. Yeah. Just like that. Leprosy. Yeah. Yeah. Deadline. So what else is ahead in the rest of 2013? Uh, we spent the last two weekends at the what is it called? The School of Audio Engineering in yeah. Hollywood. It's like an Australian I believe. And um, we recorded a single and it's really good. I'm really excited about it. We're gonna play it later tonight. And uh, we have it tracked but not mixed. And that's where we're sitting right now. So in the next maybe a month, two months, we should have it ready to release and it should show up on Spotify or on Facebook or wherever. You know. And speaking of that, where can people find you online? Yeah, I think the easiest is Facebook, you know, you just Facebook.com slash the shape of the earth. Otherwise Bandcamp, right? That's the other most popular one. Is my face still around? My face is I, we have an account. It's a ghost town. My face? Or oh, my space. My oh my space. Yeah, that no one on my face. That's another set. We well, know about your face. Your face. That's my set. Okay. Right. Thank you guys so much. I can't wait to hear the porn tonight. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you for the interview. All right. Thank you for having us. Yes. Keep it going.